locust swarm, 400 times stronger, is coming. Two new generations of locusts set to descend on East Africa yet again, according to courts. The local WhatsApp hotline, pinging nonstop as farmers and herders across large swaths of rural Kenya, send video clips of massive swarms flying overhead, blocking the light of the sun, like biblical plagues. This infestation of desert locusts first arrived in East Africa last June, feeding on hundreds of thousands of hectares of crops and pasture land and chomping a path of destruction through at least eight count countries of Africa, Kenya, Uganda, South Sudan, Ethiopia, Somalia, Eritrea, Djibouti, and Sudan. We know Ethiopia is just south of uh, um, Egypt. Scient that's, that whole area is devastated. Scientists say these devastating insects never left East Africa. In fact, they say favorable wet conditions due to above average rainfall this season means they're likely to achieve two generations of new breeding by this June, June of this year, increasing their population size up to 400 times. That is unbelievably terrible. And they're supposedly going into Pakistan, India, and also China. East Africa already has 20 million severely food insecure people who barely eat enough to fill their stomachs every day, according to the United Nations Food and Agriculture Organization, UNFAO, the body responsible for overseeing the locust, resp locust response. This new wave of locusts poses serious threat to food security in a region recently devastated by conflict and climate change shocks. They include extreme droughts and floods, and now anticipating a sharp rise in the COVID-19 infections. Farmers and pastoralists have not gotten a break at all, near these shepherds. And Keith Cressman, UNFAO senior locust forecaster says, the desert locust is a winged insect traveling in swarms, consuming almost every leaf of green vegetation in its wake. A typical swarm consists of up to 150 million locusts per square kilometer. These insects move in a wind and can migrate as far as 150 kilometers in one day. Even a tiny one square kilometer locust swarm is capable of consuming the same amount of food in one day as 35,000 people. That's a whole city. The locust infestation originated in the Arabian Peninsula. In 2018, two cyclones dumped heavy rain on an in uninhabited portion of the Arabian Peninsula, creating an ideal wet, sandy condition of the desert locusts required to breed there. Three generations of breeding occurred in nine months, causing locust numbers to increase by 8,000 times and formed the original source of the East African upsurge that's still plaguing the region today. And this is on WND, and I'll leave links below for you for this. If you'd like to join me on my Patreon account, you will hear content not covered by mainstream media. These riveting stories will be based on my research and I will state my opinions and give my personal insight on diverse and controversial subjects and world events, events not covered by mainstream media and not certainly on not supported by YouTube guidelines. So whatever I have on my Patreon, most of those will not be on my YouTube channel. Please consider becoming a member today. More of the, the most significant and important videos will be on my Patreon channel. Your support helps me to continue my research and keeps this YouTube channel alive. And we depend on your support, your generous charity, because we help economically challenged families here in Athens, Greece, in Kapota, and we also help the young generation with university tuition and the community around our church. Thank you.